Hi guys, how are you? Welcome to my YouTube channel Vision Innovative. So today we discuss why do honeybees die after they sting you? A honeybee will sting when it receives a threat to its hive. But when it is away from the hive for digging, it will rarely sting unless someone stops on it or handles it roughly. And when it does sting, it dies a honeybee stinger is made of two barded lancets. When the bee stings, it cannot pull the stinger back out. It leaves behind not only the stinger but also part of its digestive tract, plus muscles and nerves. This massive abdominal rupture is what kills the bee. But there is an advantage for the bee in this, even after it Sort the bee away, a cluster of nerve cell coordinates the muscles of the stinger left. Behind the stinger left, the barbed sap rub back and forth, digging deeper into your skin. Muscular valves pump toxins from an attached venom sac and deliver it to the wound for several minutes after the bee is gone. You might have heard people say you should flick up the stinger or scrap it rather than pinch it off. But since the stinger continues to work after the bee is gone, it is only essential that you remove it quickly. Studies show that it does not matter how and even a few second delay in debating how to remove it can have a determinable effect. Although an individual bee dies when it stings, this makes sense from an evolutionary perspective. Since the worker bees that defend the hive do not reproduce, the only way they can ensure their genes are passed on is by protecting the hive and their reproductive relatives inside. Other stinging insects like yellow jackets and hornets do not die when they sting you. These insects have a special sheath that slides over the barbed stinger and disengages the hawks. It is possible that this space benefits less than bees do from suicide defense because they are relatively inaccessible. Honeyless nets are not attacked as often, or perhaps they are faster fillers and more likely to evade a sword during a sting attack. When a bee stings you, it gives off a mixture of alarm pheromones from a gland near the sting chamber. These pheromones excite the other bees in this hive, who will open their mandibles, protrude their stringers and string anything that move close to them. The process of leaving behind a body part as a form of defense, in this case, part of the abdomen is called autotomy. Other examples in the animal kingdom include lizards dropping their tails and crabs leaving their claws behind when they are threatened. When a honeybee stings a mammal, its barbed sting lodges in the skin and the honeybee cannot remove it. Instead, it leaves the double lancet behind along with a part of its digestive tract, muscle and nerve. This abdominal rupture is what kills the bee. So this is all for today's video. If you are not subscribed my channel, please subscribe and press the bell icon for latest video notification. Thank you.